Nick my Walkman. How am I going to survive a 20-minute bus ride without my Walkman? Jerry! Yes? I've taken all my jewellery, including that beautiful sapphire ring you bought me for our anniversary. Never mind, dear. It was only an incredibly expensive ring. Could have been worth. My headphones. They missed the headphones. It's not the same, though. That's them. It's them. They brought everything back. It was all a mistake. All right. Yeah? Detective Sergeant Morris, CID. Oh, detective. Come in. <clears throat> I believe one of our officers spoke to your son earlier. Yes. They did all this. Well, my son did some of it, looking for his headphones, but they did it all, really. Probably a big gang, I should say. One of those criminal teams that come in from the continent, sweeps through the country and is gone before you know it. No, local villains, probably. This is the fourth round here this week. This was in front of the fridge. I wanted a snack. Oh, look what they've done to Mother. Yeah, well, it's not all bad then. <laughs> Still, he will, he will get, uh, get them soon, won't you? Maybe. Probably not. Yes, but we will get our things back, won't we? I mean, I mean you put out descriptions, that sort of thing. Was it marked? Well, it was slightly scratched, yeah. No, marked with your postcode or such like. Oh, yeah, we know all about that. Security pens, ultraviolet, that sort of thing, yeah. No, it wasn't marked at all. I can't find your cricket bat either, Dad. Oh, not my bat. Well, what do they want with your bat? It's a genuine antique, that is, signed by the entire Derbyshire side of 1954. I had that at school. It was a family heirloom. But a lot of that will mean to those yobs. No, I just need to get some details here. Yeah? Uh, can I get you something to drink, officer? Well, that's gone too. Oh, no. Orange juice? Uh, no, thanks. After I've taken some details, I'll arrange a visit by the scenes of crime, officer. My leather jacket! The one with the skull-shaping stud! Who will be taking fingerprints. So you should touch nothing. Kevin, don't touch anything! I'm going to become a lot fiend like JC. I'm going to have expensive alarms. I'm going to have infrared detectors. I'm going to have radar in the garden. I'm going to have track... At first, sir. And th th then what do, what do they do? Well, well, it depends. Uh, well, you could start by closing your kitchen windows. Jerry, no! Well, how is the cat going to get in? Then good locks and all your downstairs doors and windows. A few lights on when you go out, and not just in the hall. It's too easy, really. Oh, my file of facts, Gene. Howard. Look, what you want is the crime prevention officer. It's all in this leaflet. Oh, it's very kind, but I, I'd like to write it down in my uh, file. Hello. Oh, JC. My file of facts. Ah, oh, yes. Well, I meant I meant to leave it with you, JC, so that I could write down more of that fascinating stuff about security. Yes, yes, I know you didn't get where you were today by not... What? Yes, tomorrow will be fine. What pipes? Oh, our pipes, yes. Yeah. Uh, the plumbers here at the moment. Yes. <laughs> Bye. My boss. Got a thing about plumbers. <laughs> it takes all sorts. Oh, come in, Redford. A wonderful evening, JC. Sorry we had to dash off. Yes, I suppose you've come back for that damn... Notebook thing of yours covered in garlic butter. I don't know why you left it. I thought you chaps wrote half your life in those things. What do you want to leave it lying around for? Well, it's probably during the panic, you know, over the burglary. Burglary? Just a little one. Weren't you alarmed? I was absolutely flabbergasted. No, no, burglar alarms. Oh, we were waiting to see which one you would recommend for installation. When you get your promotion, Redford, you'll have to take more precautions. Why, you might have important company papers to take home. When I... Get my promotion. I'll get your notebook thing. Yeah. Here's your notebook and that uh, leaflet I gave you. Make sure you read it. Oh, don't worry, I'm going to read everything now. Install everything. Whatever the cost. My God, Redford! The main alarm. You haven't touched it. Me? Ne never. 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 Oh, no! Redford, you blithering idiot!
Hello, it's Britannia Security Systems. We have an intruder alarm for you. The alarm is at Mr John Carruthers. Report from you, Treble 9, from Britannia Securities of Kent. Of an intruder alarm. The house called Lakeside. Ha <laughs> ha! 